All right, <clears throat> here we go. It's gonna take a little ride today. It's Saturday, it's absolutely beautiful outside. Just put the new Shinko 705s on yesterday. And we're gonna take a ride. So, um, I went with the 705s, as you saw in my last video, uh, for several reasons. We're going to find out how they go. Went and put some uh, gas in a little while ago. It's getting a little low. Quite a few bikes I saw. There's a gun show going on over there this weekend too. Any of you uh, local people that live here in the Sierra Vista area, all right, here we go. That was a short light. And so the Charleston Road Bridge. You know, I remember when we used to drive across this thing. Looks 
someone's camping over there. <clears throat> Let's walk over there. So I remember when we were kids, well, not kids, but younger, at least back in the 80s, <laughs> we used to actually drive our cars across this bridge. It was a one-lane bridge. It is a one-lane bridge. This goes across the... Uh, river here. It's dry. There's some water in here. The San Pedro. Uh, There's a lot of uh, accidents out here back in the day. And there's, you know, with any old road and bridge, there's always a story with it. Or two. And I remember... There was the uh, story of the Charleston Road Witch. And uh, basically the story went something along the line that uh, there was a crash out here and she would come out here at night, her ghost, and stand on one end of the bridge and uh, hitchhike to go to the other side because they never made it. And all she wanted to do was go from one side to the other. Uh, a lot of locks out here too. People come out here and put locks and stuff. But uh, yeah, that was kind of the story. At least the one that I knew of anyway. And part of the... Uh, legend was that if you didn't if you saw her and did not stop to pick her up that you would have a crash somewhere along the Charleston Road I never saw it so I can't hold as to any truths to any of it but that's what they say anyway so yeah we used to come out to Tombstone and we'd uh, we'd drive across this old bridge and then of course they built the new well it ain't new but they built the modern bridge and uh, closed this off pretty cool old place man Pretty cool little place. So, off that way, the road, we passed a road just a little bit ago. It was called Escapool Road. Uh, and you'd go down Escapool Road, and there's some roads that lead off of that, and back over that direction was a place we called the Bluffs. And everybody used to go down there and party it up, man. All the four-wheelers and motorcycles and quads, well, ATCs, the three-wheelers. On the weekends, that's where everybody went. A lot of fun out here. All right, let's motor on. I think we'll take a run on out to Tombstone. <clears throat> Pretty cool little place. A lot of history here. What's that marker say there? <clears throat> Mormon Battalion LDS Church Battle of the Bulls erected 1960 
Huh. All right. Here we go. And here we are, Tombstone, Arizona, the town too tough to die. Nice little ride out Charleston Road. stagecoach that's pretty much it I mean just an old tourist attraction now historical town though that was Allen Street back there A lot of guys on bikes right out here on the weekends. You know what? OK Corral's gunfight at the OK Corral. 